welcome to my channel, welcome back to my channel, and welcome to Inverley. We're in the garden, and I am super excited. So one of my little passion projects is um, what I am calling the piano. Yes, and I have found some upright pianos that um, are at the end of their life with their owners, and you know, you find a lot of these pianos that nobody's going to do anything with, that... Um, but nobody knows what to do with because you can't put a piano in the bin. Like, how are you? You can't. You can't put a piano in the bin. So, what I want to do is make a piano with um, flowers. I'll probably, like, I have these, I have some, like, inspiration images of pianos um, with beautiful flowers in them. There's a dog. Hi. Hi, Bella. Um, beautiful pianos with flowers coming out of them and just really being a part of the garden. So I want flowers on the top, and then underneath, I'm gonna make a bee hotel so that our local bee, the Australian blue banded bee, can come and uh, collect pollen and pollinate our orchard. And I really wanna help um, nourish and encourage the growth of our local bee population. So this is my dream. It's called the Beano. And if this sounds exciting, please subscribe, join along. This is part one, because this is gonna be kind of a journey. Um, and I can't wait to share it all with you. Let's go get a piano, which is kind of the hardest part, to be honest. So how I found uh, my pianos is I went just to Facebook Marketplace. To be honest, search near me. Loads of people are trying to give away pianos for free. Um, as we said, they're really, they're heavy. They're hard to move. It is not an easy time. So I looked for pianos that were closest to me and freest to me. And that is how we found both of the ones that are currently residing in the garden and part of this wonderful project. <laughs> Strapping her in. Look how pretty she is. So perfect and ready to paint on. <sighs> yes, let's go to your new home, Piano. <laughs> Look, all the bees are gonna live under there. How perfect is that? Bees, bees under there. Right. Flowers on the top. The so we've got the piano on a trailer. And here it comes. Rose pulling up. We are, um, we're gonna put it probably somewhere over here for now because um, we've got lots of stuff to get rid of. All of this stuff, this is our property as well. So. All this stuff needs to go. There's some sheep. <laughs> so for now, we'll put it down here and we'll give it a new home later. So here she is. Um, I think likely she'll end up more over there. But for the net, we're here. Pull this off. See what's underneath. It's so exciting. It is not in good shape though. Yeah, I think I'm gonna pull this off. I think I need two hands to pull that off. This is the inside of a piano. Oh yeah. Oh wow. Okay, this is the inside of the piano. So I think I like, this will be. We, need to make a to put in it. we do need it. Yeah, we're gonna need a planter. I think a little planter box, or just even a few, a few little them. planter boxes, and then let them overgrow. Yeah. Um, and I was thinking of putting a hook, a couple hooks on the side. Although, like, I could hang, I could have some little ones hanging too from the top, by the side. 
and then oh yeah and then under here and this is where all the bees will live in the piano um we'll make a nice little bee house in there and the piano shall have a new life for the wildlife so then i had to look up what kind of flowers the bees in my area prefer. Not all bees like the same kinds of flowers and I am not um, super familiar with the Australian bees and what they like. So I really want to get the blue banded bee, uh, which is our local bee. So I had to do a little bit of research before I went to get some seeds. So this is what I did. Decided what flowers I wanted and then we could go get some. So many. Okay. Look at all of the. Wow, oh, there's so many ones. Um, wow. Okay. Also, some over here. Bee friendly flower mix. But what's in them? Oh, you can sell them anytime. That's great. Except maybe in the dead of winter. <laughs> Interesting. Hmm. Okay, hold on to this. Oh, those aren't the bees that I want. I want the blue ones. Where's the blue banded bee? Oh, can it? Okay. More bees. What's this? Oh. Honeybee attractor. Oh, I don't want the honeybees. I want the blue banded bees. Those are my favorites. Okay. I've got so many. I want some of everything. I also want some spicy um, pepper seeds because I like to grow spicy peppers. And then make them into hot sauce. Oh, look at all of these. So many of these will be so perfect for the piano. Okay. Ooh, okay. Chili. Oh no. Oh no. Stop that throwing chilies in. Ooh, those are jalapenos. I want those anyway. Okay. Let's have some jalapenos. Let's have some these chilies. Okay, I clearly need two hands for this. So I'm gonna get the seeds and then I'm gonna get some I'm gonna find which of these flowers are the best that the blue banded bees like the most. I'm gonna get them and then we're gonna grow them. It's gonna be great. They're, they're charging. I don't know how much they're charging, but it's more than what we can make for. So this is like a cute little bed and breakfast kit for bees, but we can easily build this. So today we are planting um, we've got this beautiful, beautiful potting mix that Keith has made for me. We've got some little labels, we've got my little tray inserts, and we are going to plant. I'm going to plant some peppers. We're also going to start these, this flower mix here. And because it is winter, we're going to start them in the germination tray and then once they sprout and are going and it's warmer out, then we can put them into the piano. It's so exciting. I am gonna just pour this. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It literally just says to pour it. <laughs> I wonder if it's because it's got seeds mixed in the, yeah. the sort of looks like sawdust. A lot it of it kind of does, it. yeah. Okay, so it's been a couple of days. This lovely heating box is doing such a great job. Let's have a look inside. Oh my gosh. Look. Okay, there's the pepper guy starting. Oh wow. Look at all of these. Oh wow, they're like, okay, this is really holding in the moisture. They are just beautiful. So there's a dial up at the front of this germination box. You can, oh, you can see it in the mirror. 
and I have set it to 20 um, because that kind of feels like the right temperature. These, wow. I'm gonna leave it open for a minute, let some of the um, dampness come out. Um, only because like some of those are looking really, uh, really damp. So I haven't watered them in a few days either because this box really holds in all of the moisture. So I'm gonna leave it open until I get ready for it and then I'll put the lid back on, but the box is still warm, so whee! All right, so this is a little shelter that is in the back of the property that we are getting rid of. Um, you, for reference, there's the pianos. So we are demolishing that guy and I've got some pieces from it that I've semi-measured in the piano. So we're gonna turn these into the bee hotel and stuff it full of some bamboo and things that uh, bees like to nest in. Okay, so here we are. Belle is very excited. We are. This is, this is the stuff we're gonna take. So it's quite the length. There's a bunch of, put these down. There's a bunch of these that are already down. So as you see the, the little segments, we'll be able to cut them and see, yeah. So like you can see they have little segments. So then in there is where the bees will very happily Live. Yeah, right. <laughs> so we'll just cut them along those little nodules and then put them into the bee house. So, oh yeah, Rose found a nice patch. Look at those. Oh. Did you peek things down because someone else is? No, I think they've fallen down. Pile. I think someone oh. just cut it down. And, uh, Perfect. Yeah. Okay, let's harvest. Let's just see. Here we are. Now, this is the piano. And that is gonna stay right there. This is just uh, another garden piano. We need it to be over there. So, we are gonna move a piano. This one, this one, I'm gonna plant um, climbing, some climbing flowers to come all the way up and like through all the metal. And it's gonna be really, really cool. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for joining me today here, Erica Amber Home. And I am so excited to continue on with my piano journey. And if this is something that you wanna follow along with, please subscribe, hit that bell. And I will see you in the next video with the next adventure. Bye. Thank you.